I want to show you guys something if the computer doesn't erase it. Hold up, okay? I got a lot of garbage going on in my life. And today we fuck everybody. And we do it in a way that is perfectly legal, you know? So, there's some water droplets. If the water drops on the stop button and it shuts off, I have to restart the video. Thanks, my amazing man, Dare to Speak. His name is Mike. We talked on the phone for a long ass time. And he's an amazing person. Because I even said it when I was getting fucked up. Or like Mike said, abducted by the fucking extraterrestrials. Even Derek acknowledged it. Derek Leslie, and also thanks to Brenchy Suarez. These people are helping me see the truth. So unfortunately, if you say, wow, I see the street, I see block, I see people, I see the sky and buildings and cars, and it's all a fucking bullshit hoax. As sad as it is, it is a legitimate hoax. Okay? Because I had... Uh, uh, out of body experience, except this bed was this way, and it was facing this, and I say it again, that it happened three times, but one time it was so scary because it was 8 o'clock or 8.30, okay, and the sky was bright like this, and I cursed out Jeannie, who supposedly got my ex-girlfriend, and when I f cursed my ex-girlfriend, the whole sky got black, and I'm talking about not like a thunderstorm, you know, like black or, or, or um, you know, Gray, dark, gray, dark, black. I'm talking about the shit literally look like nighttime. Okay. I don't know. This is... And, and also, this is another thing that I don't have to worry about. I, I try to record the guy didn't work. You know, because people are not people. They're all extraterrestrial. And the proof of it is because the extraterrestrials, you know, the people that you see, for example, especially a gangster. Okay. The gangsters... They have super strength, super speed, they can teleport, they can have telekinesis, they can read brains, and they know it. They have these psychic abilities and these godlike abilities because they're, 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 what's that word? They are not human, okay? And I'm not just talking about gangsters, regular people, even myself, is a ET. Everyone is an ET, literally. God told me that out of all of existence, only this much of people are normal and good and loving, you know, and human. But the rest is all E.T., evil, bad, negative motherfuckers, and that's it. Even this, like, um, see, this is an orange juice. This is some weird thing my mom made. It was, it was good in a way, but some of it I didn't like. And then this, I think, has the chicken and rice in it. But... To another person on another planet, it'll be different. So without Brenchy and Derek and Mike, especially him, I wouldn't have known. His name is Dare to Speak. That's his screen name on TikTok. You could do YouTube, but TikTok is better. I text him. We talked on the phone year, <clears throat> years ago. And the reality is, if you really want to do the life and ex expose these bitches, you got to do the things that make you happy, which is what I'm recording. I love motor vehicles, all of them, okay? Every fucking one of them. And the reality, okay, the reality is you got to enjoy yourself. And, you know, it's kind of even horror. It's like there are some people that talk about, like, the Masons and all that. But they're not even actual Masons. Like, they're not just human beings. They're actually extraterrestrials. And I'll say it again, 99.9% .9 of all existence, I told you, out of all of existence, there's only this much humans. The rest are all extraterrestrials. The wool, the TV, the floor, the paint, you know, your skin, your hair, it's all extraterrestrial. I'm trying to do something I thought I saw a cut in my mouth. There's a lot of sick motherfuckers, and they're not human. That's why a lot of these Gs, these gangsters, they got this strength. They got this unreal strength that is not normal because they're uh, ETs. Everything you see is an ET. And I'll say it and I'll say it again. I had the worst thing in the whole universe, okay? I actually had this encounter, but it was freaky because it's like 
over the past year or something like that, I had like about two or three surgeries, okay, in, in my dream, like encounter. And now, today I had nine surgeries. They, I, I, they, they, they were putting screws over here, right in the middle of the head. Uh, the chest plate, the intestines, the heart, I think they put a new heart in me. Um, and it's true too, you know, like staying back, another ET. If something is coming out your mouth, that means it's true. Sometimes you can say things and you don't even know, and that's just the spirits fucking with you. And uh, what else? They did one on my leg. They, they bent my leg and then they refixed it. And then my grandma took me to her house, you know, in Avenue Well. But even that is garbage, you know, because of, out of all the things in life, you know, it's not worth it to be a smart person and have misery. That's why a lot of people say that they want to be retarded. So even though I have the looks of a retarded person, but I'm not, you know what I'm saying? But trust me, I would rather like Oreo Man Brandon, you know, I would go donate to him Brandon Lock Heart, right? Or is it Brandon Lock 125? Um, and a lot of more official, these amazing people. And it breaks my heart because what I don't understand is that why couldn't I just live a normal life? You know, and then another sad thing is that this is not real. You know, aliens created this. You know, and I had, uh, I was sleeping here, over here, and uh, they fucking, they drilled my ass. They anesthesiated me. I don't know how they did it, anesthesia, but they did it, and I just blacked out, and all I heard was the screws. You know, I'm like, what the fuck? But I gotta be honest with you, though. You know, like, I don't know how to explain this, but there's only one way to explain it, you know? It's kind of like, um, it's kind of like, um, I forgot, but, you know, since I know that everyone's extraterrestrial, including myself, then what in the world is the point of having a life here on Earth? Because everyone is a fucking E.T., so what's the purpose? Just be alone, you know? And, uh, it was a very sad thing. You know, and then actually after the nine surgeries, okay, they did surgery on me. I think it was like six in the morning, and then I woke up nine o'clock, and they tried to surgery me again. I mean, I, I don't know if they did, but I felt it, and I put a blanket over my head, and that protect me. It didn't feel like it did. Like, when I put the blanket over my head, I could still see them coming, but all of a sudden, they're not touching me. So, definitely sleep with... That's why when you're a little kid, you put the pull the covers. It's actually a force field. Kids are not doing that in vain. It's actually good. It protects you if you put the thing. The blanket, that's why we love blankets, right? The blanket is a force field, okay? And you just do that, right? And you go underneath and you won't get touched, you know? But I keep telling myself this is not real because it's scary, you know? This is not real and then you find out it is real, you know? Mm -hmm. That's my little light. I had a, a light. Where did the light go? Where's the light? Oh, there it is. See the light? It's a, it's a thing that hurts me. It really hurts me. But now that I know that it's all extraterrestrial, I can focus on my stuff. That's why a lot of people focus on their dreams and their goals and what they want to do in life because they know that the world is nothing in the world. And also heaven has nothing to offer. Right? And hell has nothing to offer. It's all about you. That's why my mother told me it's all about you. I'm gonna, my mom, she bought some juice. She bought some juice. After this experience, this wild ride that I had for years, um, I will never look at the world the same. Never again. And the funny thing is, I always said it, that people also said it that were in the hospital that you never had any actual experiences. I mean, people astro project, you know, but I noticed that the astro projection, it was more like a good thing, I think. But when I started taking the drugs, oh, that made me even astro project more. Yeah. So, as much as it hurts me, okay, and also God is also an alien, and so is Satan. This, I put my hopes in it for nothing. I mean, I still love my, you know, 
my family, you know, I respect their beliefs, but I'm not going to fucking hurt myself for it. Why does it feel like there's fucking gasoline in this, in this orange juice? Because my mom said she'll never leave um, chemicals in the house. But chemicals, like, for example, when my mom leaves chemicals, for example, out in the open like that, believe it or not, she's not doing it because she wants to do that. The, the aliens are making her do it. The aliens actually make people do a lot of things, and you don't want to do it. They, they have you by the throat, you know? Like I said, stupid shit, like, I had this weird thing that I used to like holding my crap because it made me feel good. Like, I think it's the drugs or something. And it made me feel good to do, you know, to, to hold my crap. Okay? And that story is up for another time. And I'm allowed to do what I want if I want to take a, you know, like this, you see, a bath. I have a right. Okay? So my mother's really not an evil person. She's just doing evil things through the aliens. They're forcing her to do stuff that she doesn't want to do. Same thing with using the toilet. You know, the medication makes me use the toilet all the time. But that's not that's not my fault, you know? So I want to hold the crap, but it's like something makes me move. Like, put it this way. If you are doing, if you're making a movement physical and you really don't want to do it, but you're doing it and you don't know why, that's the aliens making you do it. Uh-huh. They call them alien, alien Zeta Grays. They actually, um, they have gray, they're all gray with those big ass black eyes. And everybody's also making reports about it, not just me. A lot of people are making that thing. Sometimes I feel like I want to do this only 15 minutes because if you do it longer than that, unfortunately, you know, it doesn't work. Now watch this. You see that car? It's like a dark car. That guy actually threatened his daughter to assault her because, you know, she didn't answer his calls. But you see, I can't go up to the guy and have a fight with him because he's not human. He's an extraterrestrial like everybody else. And since he has, you know, a lot of, like like I said, gangsters, again, they got super strength, they got super speed, they can teleport, they can read brains and uh, move things with their brain, with their mind. So if you are, let's say, a strong man, right, and you can bench press 480 pounds, okay, or, for example, there's a professional bodybuilder, right, Let's say he can do 500 something pounds, right? But the gangster, like this guy over here, I wouldn't be surprised if he bench presses 1,200 pounds. Because these fucking gangsters, they have that, that ability. Now here's the cool part. Now that I know that all this is extraterrestrial, I can focus more on my goals and dreams and the things that I want and I can play video games and I can enjoy life. And obviously I cannot go to sleep on my bed because I'll get a nightmare because here's the saddest part of it all. You know, I never had severe nightmares, N never. I had like a worst case scenario, I had like five nightmares in a whole year. But when I started taking medication, I had nightmares Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and it was multiple. Like Monday would be three nightmares, Tuesday would be ten nightmares, Wednesday would be like five nightmares, and it would it would be like that from 2000. Uh, I would say, if I could guess, I would say 2013, and we're in 2024. That's 11 plus 12 plus years of nightmares, five times a night, three times a night, ten times a night for nothing. So. I'm going to shut this off because it's going to, you know, I mean, I don't want to take the chance of it not working past 15 minutes. So we'll either do a part two or we'll see what happens. I'm going to post this one right now.